chromosome, chromatid, and chromatin. What are the differences? So in our last video, we talked about chromosomes, sister chromatids and non-sister chromatids. So today, we are going to be drawing a little comparison between chromosome, chromatid, and chromatin. So again, today we have our chromosome. This is our chromosome here. Okay, so we say that chromosome is made up of two strands, right? This strand and this strand makes up the chromosome. Okay, now each of these strands is what we call the chromatid. One chromatid, one chromatid, two sister chromatids, right? Okay, now what is a chromatin? What is a chromatin? So now let's look at these two strands. Let's use this one as our model. Now you see that this chromatid has other tiny threads that make up this bundle of cells, right? So the chromatin is the tiny cell this tiny thread so this thread is so long it's very long and this is the dna molecule right but it has to be compact it has to coil and super coil to form this chromosome structure so at this thread like stage this is what we call the chromatin at this thread like stage so remember all of these are all forms of dna whether chromosome chromatid or chromatin they are all forms of DNA so but when we talk about chromatin we're talking about the thread like structure at the thread like stage when it is at this stage it is called the chromatin and then when it is condensed coiled and super coiled um, it, it forms um, what we call the chromosome and in our next video we are going to be explaining in detail what the chromosome actually means how it is formed and the structure of the chromosome